Hello Celtic supporters, welcome to the Celtic News Channel. If you love this club from the bottom of your heart, hit the like button. Here, I bring you the latest updates about our beloved club. And today, I have some extremely important news for the loyal Celtic fans that's causing a lot of uncertainty for coach Brendan Rodgers, and concern for the green and white faithful. Speaking of fans, I want to invite you to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications because I bring you the latest Celtic updates every day. In the world of football, Celtic is facing a significant challenge in finding a suitable replacement for Gustav Lagerbilke for the upcoming Champions League. Group stage match, following a 2-0 defeat to Feyenoord on September 19, which resulted in Lagerbilke's expulsion with a second yellow card. Coach Brendan Rodgers is grappling with a real selection headache for the next match against Lazio scheduled for October 4. With Lagerbilke suspended for the match, there's a void in Celtic's defence, and the available options are limited. New signings Nat Phillips and Mike Naroki are still unavailable due to injuries, with Naroki not even being part of Celtic's European squad for the Champions League. Cameron Carter-Vickers and Stephen Welsh are also in the medical department although Carter Vickers recovery is expected next month. Tomoki Iwata was called upon to replace Lagerbilke in the match in the Netherlands, but the opinion of former players like Alan Hutton is that he is not the best choice for the centre-back position. I don't see Iwata as a central defender, Hutton stated. The situation is surprising, considering Celtic invested in the acquisition of defenders but now faces a shortage of options due to injuries. However, there is hope with Liam Scales' performance since his arrival. Phillips remains a question mark regarding the duration of his absence, but someone will have to step up. We await to see how the list of available players unfolds in the coming weeks. So, green and white supporters, what do you think of this news? Who should step in for Lagerbilke? It's always essential for you to comment so that Celtic knows what its fans are thinking, and of course, if you've made it this far, leave a like to motivate me to bring you more Glasgow Celtic news, hail hail.